This is the baffling story of Jay Paul Hill's disappearance and mysterious death. Jay was a smart and popular 20-year-old majoring in photography at Columbia, but something disturbing would happen to him on February 28th of 2010. On Sunday night, Jay went to a party, and he was supposed to meet his girlfriend at a dorm later that night, but he never made it. Shockingly, on March 2nd, Jay's body was removed from the Calumet River, 20 miles away from the campus. He was naked from the waist down and only had a t-shirt on, but there was no sign of sexual assault and he had no drugs or alcohol in his system. He did, however, have bad skull fractures on either side of his head as well as a broken bone in his neck. His cause of death was also listed as drowning. His family hired a private investigator who thinks he was murdered, but Chicago detectives couldn't find any leads. I tend to agree with the PI's opinion, but who would want to murder Jay and why? He was very well liked. Also, why wasn't there any evidence found and his death wasn't listed as a homicide?